69, dudes! <gasps> Go, beatbox time. <laughs> On today's show, uh, we have some, uh, let's set the mood, because we're going to make things moody, drunks, Phil meets the movies, WTF, music, oops, and I threw in a couple last videos there, and that's good. Let's start the show. Let, let's go. Welcome let's to go. season seven of the TP show. So hold on to your butts. You're in for experience like no other. You are about to partake in the most bodacious right. experience ever. Take in the professor show. Go. Show. You know. That's us. What button I always have like ready to go and I know exactly where it is every single time. No, which one's that? You got fancy buttons, everybody. Fancy yep. buttons. <laughs> you have that one ready. Like no matter on speed what. Dial. Yep. I watch, watch, watch. You got fancy watch. buttons, everybody. Fancy yep. buttons. See, I just know where it's at every single time. <laughs> that's the that's the only button I know that I've trained you on since I've done such an amazing job with the fancy buttons. I'm just glad that, that I noticed that, that we weren't. You have to be on. One or two? All of them. <laughs> all of them. All of them. All of them. All of them. Just like a whole handful. <laughs> That's what they do. <laughs> Um, oh, so good. Uh, oh, that's yeah, I'm just glad that I saw it before we got too far in the show. Nothing drives me more crazy than yeah. to not be recording. I mean, that's the whole point to the show. <clears throat> but I could always grab it off the stream if I had to. So that leads us to drinks. Did you drink, drink, to drink, drinks, drinks? Um, mine's simple. I just have water, water in a, in a um, fancy cup. Mine's even better. Mine is air. Uh, since I've had so many spills in the studio, I haven't quite come up with a thing that air. Yeah, exactly. Wow. Wow. Yeah, that looks weird, though. That looks scary. <laughs> Not in that good gay way. Uh, so. Sexual. So sexual. <laughs> do you know what they call that dance move that you just did? No. What do they call that? In the Bukaki special. Wow, that's a dollar of that's more. Of course, that's what they call that. <laughs> Is one hundred percent the Bukaki specials. Buttons. They are. Oh my they god! Are. So uh, <laughs> uh, let me do. Breaking news! Breaking news! Elmo breaking news. Isn't breaking that how news. breaking news goes? So this week uh, we <laughs> I did an Elmo voice. This week uh, we do yeah. not have a metal mind melter, and for good reason. Uh, I was following the story. Uh, so the way it works with our partners, both Phil and uh, Rob, on Friday, I try to remember to reach out to them and go, hey, uh, don't forget we have a show on Tuesday. That gives them plenty of time to get ready. Yeah. And um, this week I forgot, and I got a hold of Rob on Saturday. And when I went to get a hold of him, I went. I, I do it via Facebook. I'm old. So I went to his Facebook page, and apparently – his dog ran away when he was at the oh, park. Oh no! And I was like, "Screw oh. metal mind melters! Like, dude, take care of yeah. life." You know what I mean? Yes, one hundred percent. And then today, I got this news. Okay, maybe I didn't okay. get that news. Oh, that's an interesting sound. I don't think I've ever had that sound before. Hmm. I love wow. this. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Sasha. Oh, oh, so someone was just keeping her there? No, well they found her. Run away. No, 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 they found them. She seems dry. I'm and then and then somehow. So they went to the park. The story goes like this. They uh -huh. went to the park and uh the puppy got away. Just split. Like I'm out. I'm going I'm going that way. And they couldn't get him. Yeah. Could not find him. And then they put out wow. the call on the interwebs. Hey, help yeah. me find my puppy. And then this kind of young man found the puppy and he went and got him. So that's, that's what I said. I was like, I like a happy ending. I was actually. <laughs> uh, I was worried. A like, bunch of time. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you've ever lost a puppy, uh, you understand what's going on there. Uh, yeah. And if you haven't lost a puppy, then you are very lucky. That's all I have to say. Um, yeah, because at some point the dog runs so far and so out of the way where you, you just have to give up. You're like, I don't know. I yes. just, I don't know. 
Yeah. Also, most dogs, is, well, my dog do specifically, no, my dog especially gets scared of stuff. <laughs> so when it gets scared, yeah. it just hides. So like if it ran, got scared and hid, I'd be like, pixel, pixel. And I probably uh, and I, I probably would be in the bushes, like come back right. home full of yeah. ticks, something good like that. Uh, <laughs> that was that. That was that. And it is time for. Hey there, fellow thrill seekers. I'm Megan, your guide to the dark and enigmatic tales that lie within the depths of the Lewis Clark Valley, nestled deep in the heart of Hell's Canyon. Join me as we unearth the secrets of times gone by, exploring historical sites across the Pacific Northwest. Have you ever wondered about the stories behind those haunted buildings? Curious about unsolved mysteries, missing people, and spine-chilling encounters? LC Valley Spooky Babes is your portal to a world of the supernatural, the unexplained, and is downright spine tingling. Each episode, I'll take you on a captivating journey through time as we unravel the threads of history's most perplexing mysteries. So grab your headphones, gather your courage, and join me on LC Valley Spooky Babes. Subscribe now on Spotify and get ready to experience the ghostly tales that still echo through the valleys as we dive deep into the heart of Lewis Clark Valley's most chilling legends. Subscribe today if you dare. Dun, 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 if you no, dare. Yeah, I will say each episode is getting better and better and better and better. That's awesome. Yeah. Back to back. Conjure tales of fear. Give me a second. Oh, rewind it. The goal rewind it. was not merely to conjure tales of fear, but to weave narratives that would ensnare the reader's imagination and draw them into a realm where the line between fiction and reality would blur. On October 1st, something hauntingly unique is coming to Spotify. Books from the shelves whispered. Follow the trail of a dreamer named Alex as he seeks to create an AI-generated scary storybook like no other. I don't think Alex but should do that. Where, as they delve deeper into their creation, just the boundaries of horror begin to blur, and the line between the digital realm and the physical world fades away. Don't miss it. Your journey into darkness awaits. Coming October 1st, only on Spotify. The goal Dude. was not merely to conjure Dude, this tales is the of fear. That's awesome. I Imagine that. what the stories sound like. So <laughs> I, I can't I can't wait. I'm super excited actually. It, it it takes me like at least just a prologue. I think there was like four thousand words, maybe a little more. That took me like eight hours with all the sound effects and everything to mix. Oh, Morocco's Batman. That's, yeah, that's like a real, <laughs> real deal. It's awesome. Oh, that, that's yeah. super awesome. But I'm just saying, like this AI thing's supposed to save time. It seems like it takes more. It takes more. It takes well, more. You know, I could just have the AI just read. But I yeah. want all the sound effects, and and I want, I want you to hear everything. There's a jump scare in it, and yeah, it's absolutely. Really cool. I I I'd much yeah. rather have like an actual interactive experience than something lame. You know what I mean? Right. So like when when like the books start like talking to him, the books actually start talking to him. Like you you actually <laughs> like hear the pages. Like it's it's awesome. Yeah, that is cool. It's really cool. Yeah. Huh. Mm. Uh, I'm trying to pick which button mm. we should use. Mm, no, 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 no. Three. Sorry. Good. By the way, I, those buttons have been deleted because of the button apocalypse. They will be coming back before the end of the season. I will. How many? <laughs> give me a number, by the way. What's the number? Like, uh, pick a number. Well, it can't be too ridiculous. Like, don't make it a thousand, but like, give me a number and I'll make that many buttons. So, I uh, seven. Seven. You got it. I'll make seven. No, no, no. I was trying to find. Uh, let's go with this, even though it doesn't fit at all. At all. At all. At no, all. it probably at doesn't. All. At all. And I, I think you'll find it funny when I put it up on screen. It's time. It's yeah. time. It's time. <laughs> what? No, that's that tick. What? <laughs> what? I what? didn't even think this <laughs> stupid was possible. That doesn't even what? That doesn't even make sense, tick. What? What are we watching now? How am I not subscribed to my own what, show? What? 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 <laughs> why? Oh why God. is that? Why is that on screen? I don't know. <laughs> I needed great. something. Um, oh, this uh, so this fast. this section is uh, 
let's set the mood. And I didn't have anything for that. Yeah, for so the we whole went show. With, yes. For the whole yeah, show. For the whole show. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. But I didn't have this, this I didn't have it. a I didn't have a title screen, so we went with cute pets because you know. Right. So <laughs> if you, if you guys don't like the next set of videos, then I don't know what you're doing here. No, definitely. This no. is our whole show. Yes. Yeah. It does <laughs> doesn't doesn't get worse than this. It's a, it right. doesn't get worse. Yeah, or, mm. Yeah, mm. this is this mm. is the bar going low. Yeah. Yeah, this yeah, is yeah. we're setting we're setting the bar <laughs> where it should be. Whoa. And then we'll so we work could, our we could go higher. Yeah. <laughs> we'll try to work yeah. up to that during the show. We'll try to work. We're like anyway. the little engine that could. Like, yeah, it's just <laughs> and it doesn't. Yeah. <laughs> right. So I used to date this guy. <laughs> <laughs> so I used to date this guy. And <laughs> oh. I don't think I'm ready to talk about that. Yet. So I used to date this guy. <laughs> So I used to date this guy, and he's. Oh, I don't think I'm ready. For that. No, she's not ready for that. She is not ready for that yet. That's our show. That's it. That's it. Oh that's man, that's, that's too it. funny. That is too incredibly funny. Oh. <laughs> Learn how to tie your shoe, loser. Learn how to tie. Come on, tie, tie, tie. My God, I would just, I, I would like get food just to watch her like torment the people that walk by because she's hilarious. Oh yeah, how she doesn't get punched <laughs> though? I'll just be honest. I've often wondered that right. about these interactive performers. She's like, hi. I'll get off and the I ground bet you now. her name's like Fruity Pebbles or something like that. You know. <laughs> Tie That's your shoe. Tie your shoe. <laughs> too funny. Loop de loo and double knot it. There she is. You guys have no idea how lucky I am that uh, I get to. I'm married to her. I have a bad what feeling. What are you looking at? I, I was watching you. You were coming up. Dude, I you just... have a problem? You're like a fucking creep. There she is. You guys have no idea how lucky I am that. Uh, okay, so a, I'm okay, so okay, so we obviously know that he gave her a creepy look. So let's do creepy looks, like when she comes back on screen again. Okay, so. All right. Uh, I get to. I'm married to her. Oh, hey. What the fuck are you looking at? Uh, you? I was watching you. You, you? were coming up. I was Dude, watching you. you. I, I, I think you're nice, and I like you. That's why we got married, remember? You know what remember I would have done married? if this happened to me? No, what would you have done? As soon as she said, what the fuck are you looking at, my door would open, and I would just get out. I'm, apparently nothing. <laughs> apparently, I've got to go shopping. <laughs> apparently, I've got to go anywhere right. before, besides where you are. Apparently. Right. <laughs> what are you looking at? I, I was watching you. You were coming I was up. watching you, of course. <laughs> <laughs> oh, give me a second. It took a second to get there. You're good. Yeah, yeah. What have we? Okay. 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 I, 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 I don't even understand it. <laughs> you, you have to smell the bottom of the pineapple to make sure it's right. Uh, we turn I, it over. She's a famous <laughs> actress, by the way. This lady over on the right, when we when we pan to her, give me one second. Let me pause it when we get to her. That lady right there is a famous actress. One thousand really? percent. Oh no! Now that I've zoomed in, it's not a famous actress anymore. Um, wah, I wah. thought it was John Larroquette. <laughs> oh, that's too funny. <laughs> that's too funny. <laughs> Oh man, no! I think there's a, uh, I think there's a subtle undercurrent that you are missing on the pineapple thing. We'll, we'll have to, we'll have to discuss I, that in I, the off hours, maybe. I don't way, know. Wait, way past, way, way yeah. past. Wait, my, wait. Down my throat and I swallowed the nut. And I'm Bang. not supposed to. Nope, 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 no, nope, no. Nope. Way, way past. No, way, way, way past. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh! Wait, wait, wait. Ooh, what is this? I like it. It's an ad. We're gonna add some 
of our audio tip. Sexual. Sexual. So next on the hit parade. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can be here the whole show, like a leg, Morty. Any progress? I found the version of me that killed my wife. You just missed it. Can I ask if you're currently a hologram? Yeah, yeah, hold uh, on. yeah, sure, you can ask, but I'm not gonna tell you. <laughs> Do we know anyone sober? Nope, so, you've been um, drinking on a Thursday. On a Thursday, when, dude, we kicked out of the show, like, yes. we got canceled. Yes. This yeah. is the, this is, this, that's what I was going to get into, actually. Let's Sets the mood out. for the show. So, yeah. they put this out so everybody could get used to the voices, because he did, like, three or four or five of the voices, and they had to replace right. him. So, what sucks is he got canceled from this, and his whole video game studio kicked him out. Yep. Yep. <laughs> He got ultimately canceled. What's the song? I was wondering if you could help me out with a bit of a rake situation. A rake situation? For anybody that doesn't know, uh, this is Rick and or Morty. Season 7. I love the music, too. I wonder which, who's going to hit us with the copyright strike. Is it going to be Rick and Morty, or is it going to be... Uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> What's their name? Uh, Ace of Spades. The Ace of Spades. Why can't I remember? Motorhead. Motorhead. There we go. Yeah. I had to put the hat on. It's a thinking hat. That's how I think. It's with a hat. I don't know about other people, but that's how I think. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. The Ace of Spades. The Ace, the Ace of, Spades. of Spades. I yeah. love that song. I, that mm -hmm. if anybody out there ever wonders why people get into music, it's to get laid. And if you don't believe me, look up Lemmy sometimes. Just look him up. Ooh. Just look him up. Yeah. I don't care if yeah. you're attracted to men or if you're attracted you to know, women. Just look up Lemmy. This is that's what I'll say. He has a face only his mother could love. He has a face for radio, as they would say. That's all I got to say about that. So um, we are flying through the show. Um, do you have any idea what we're going to be doing next? Uh, drunks. Bing. And uh, we're, are you we're excited going about that? To be doing a bunch. Oh, I'm I'm over the moon excited. Yes, That's what I like to hear. I, I'm. This is how excited I am for. Man, I put him directly over that QR code. That's hilarious. <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> That's how excited I am. See, way over the moon, went to space pants. Went to space <laughs> pants. Drunk, we drunk, 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 drunk. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Space. Went to space. <laughs> that, you did better. You did way better than I did. I did really bad. <laughs> went to space. <laughs> went to space. You know what? We should do a couple lemmies like doing our things like like Although, this one. I, 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 I have taken frothy peas before. Not that that's <laughs> Although true. I have, I have taken frothy peas before. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> You're doing it great, man. You're killing it. I'm sucking at it today. It's so. that coffee that the cats eat and then poop it out. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, it only took seven years for us to get this like smooth through the show. So we're good. <laughs> I'll just have to press buttons and screw it up then. No, I'm trying to press a button. I think I've I think I've broken the show again. Uh I know what I need to do. Give me a second. You just spoke too soon, by the way. You literally spoke too soon. You were like two seconds. If you'd waited two seconds, we would have we would have we would have had no problems at all. But no. Just, no, because because was it last week where where yeah. it was um oh god, what's his name? It was Head and uh Huckabee. They messed yes. up the whole show. A whole show. <laughs> whole show. Now, uh, before oh, we even get this. into this one, uh, like <laughs> seriously, <laughs> I, I let's put it this way. I could go strip club. Uh, I could go country western bar. 
trying to think of other options I have because oh. there's that Coyote We're Ugly going movie. Country Western bar like uh, like Coyote Roadhouse. Ugly. Yes, oh Roadhouse too. Yeah, but I was thinking Coyote Ugly the where the girls are on. Spade. The Ace of Spades. Because <laughs> it's, it's the thinness. shots. From, yeah, the shots from <laughs> girls. <laughs> the shots from girls. I just whenever I see a girl on a bar, especially when there's like three yeah. guys like. Ah, uh, right. I immediately go to strip club or or Coyote Ugly. Those are my two like go tos, and Roadhouse is a good one too. But let's let's see what happens with these drunks. It's not, it's not a Texas Roadhouse. No. You can't go to Texas Roadhouse mm. and get this. No. no, well you can try. It's you'll probably get kicked out, you, and the cops might be yeah. showing show up. Yeah, I'm sure you, you will. <laughs> You know, if I saw that as I walked in, I'd be like, nah, this is not the place for me. I'm sorry. We we got to go. You're not the demo for this. <laughs> you you didn't go, hey, I want to be spit down my throat and then have water thrown <laughs> hey, in my face. Hey, me next. Me, me next. next. Please. Well, no, please, like, please. like, here, let's stop at the beginning again. Watch, watch. There's three guys yeah. waiting for this. Three. There's actually, uh, they probably right. paid 20 or $30 for this treatment. So. Oh, I'm sure they did. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The, yeah, yeah, the yeah. next one, she's probably going to take off her shoe and pour it in it, and then they're going to drink it. Oh, yeah. So, no doubt. Yeah. Slap. And did he get slapped at the this end? Yeah, not end a slap. Place. End yeah. of slap. Not a place I want to go. Woo! No. Well, you know, I've, I'm going to be standing in line tomorrow. Uh, but yeah, it's... Uh... <laughs> at least, you know what? At least there's alcohol in it, so it kills all yeah. the dirty bad things. Of course. So. Of course. Her, her mouth couldn't yeah. have been in any bad places. No. Oh, this is going to end badly. Oh, this is going to end badly. I can just tell already. <laughs> you think so? Uh, first of all, look at how much froth there is. There's no beer. I mean, I like a little head dun dun dun, <laughs> on my beer. I, I have taken frothy peas before. I have, <laughs> but not into beer steins. Although that's an idea. Frothy beers into beer steins. Oh. This is Oktoberfest everywhere in Germany, by the way. Just make the women more buxom, and uh, and we're we're all set. Yep. I don't I don't know if she's gonna drop it or if she's just gonna drink them all. This thing. Oh, I thought she was gonna drink them all. Yeah. This Maybe isn't the most. Be. Yeah, this isn't the most impressive stack I've seen. But okay, she's starting to get there. Okay, good, 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 good. You know what? There we go. I would rather be there than that last place. One hundred percent. Hell yeah. Yeah. Hell yeah. Uh, the only only problem I have is that if she's not named Helga, then this whole thing's over. It's off. Just not. Yeah. Nope. Mm. Nope. You know, mm -hmm. or. Oh, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Because that's who she reminded me of. I agree. I agree. Totally. Wow. Wow. Yep. Wow. It's all about the beers. <laughs> the Ace of Spades. That the, song's going to be it, stuck in my head until we go to music. Oh, yeah. What are they? Oh my god. Okay, so lesson for everybody in the audience. Um, there's two ways to do things. It's called sucking and blowing, and you effed it up, buddy. That helps the marriage. <laughs> apparently. Apparently, blowing on game cartridges does not help happen marriages. to be a loose game that mm. I bought. So that means it got played a lot? One too. You blow on game cartridges and electronics, <laughs> and it makes them work great. I mean, it helps oh, a marriage a work. Remember oh, the last two I weeks I exploded on that? <laughs> yeah. I don't know if this helps the marriage. Like, let's watch this again. This is you like... Use your <laughs> he 100% did that on purpose. 100%. Oh, yeah, 100%. Did you hear you know what, you the know blowing what? sound? Did right. you hear him blow it out? You know what That's the wife should have done in the background? I don't know if that's the wife or the sister. I'll be honest. But what should she have done? Run? Now you know what it feels like. Oh, that's horrible. <laughs> that's just wrong. What if that's his daughter? That's just wrong. Wrong, wrong, oh, wrong. Yeah, and I know. love it. And that's oh, and that's the daughter's boyfriend. You're right. Oh. Right. There, right. There we now go. you're now, catching on. That's the, that's where I was going. Because yeah, that guy's yeah. too old to have that yeah. as his. But seriously, like, first of all, 
if anybody ever points a can at you, don't stand in its way because he did it wrong right from the get go. Yeah. When you're shotgunning a beer, uh, let's use this. You hold it this way and you poke the hole here, put your finger on it and then uh -huh. pop the top. Yeah. Did you, you don't go like this? You... Right. <laughs> did you bring the paper towels just in case you uh, spill your invisible drink? Uh, dude, like I've had that in here since like four drink apocalypses ago <laughs> and <laughs> two weeks ago i got the cup that is supposed to be spill proof brought it in yeah. here knocked it on the ground and it did not like explode everywhere it just went glug 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 so yeah i don't, I don't yeah know. i just I, I can't win for losing that's all i got to say about I, that i cannot I win a, for a losing camo, a, a camel bag where you just have your little <laughs> I, yeah. I don't disagree, man. I think that's a, actually a very wise plan. I should definitely do something like that. But then if I put vodka in it or something, it'll be weird. If that makes any sense, it'll be no, like... I don't think so. No. You don't think so? I, oh, no, 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 no. I'm talking no. about the plastic gets weird. I, that's what I meant. I said it wrong. The plastic oh, starts to get funky. I, I would have been alcohol. weirded out. I would have... Oh, no. I but like, I'd be like, a genius. I'd be like, a genius for doing that. I would have vodka in this. Mm -hmm. And we're just getting through the whole show. I don't know what buttons we're going to press. Nope. I don't know nope. anything. By I the second hour, we're know. done. I so, literally yeah. don't know what's going yeah. on at all. <laughs> at all. I don't even know. I don't even know. I, I really don't even know. If I have two cameras and wait, that's wait, that's not a camera that's on yet. OK, I've got two cameras. Got camera one. Camera two. Camera one. Oh. Camera oh. two. Camera one. Camera two. Camera one. Camera two. <laughs> Jesus, so many cameras. And we always end on the wrong one, too. That's the weirdest part. I, I'm I'm totally on the wrong one because I'm not oh, yeah. there. I'm, I'm yeah, there we go. Here we go. One. Okay, here we go. Next one. She's literally fine. She's fine. Oh, yeah, she's good. Don't worry. Asshole friend. <laughs> that is the four first four words out of her mouth. Turn her into an a-hole friend. So let's get back to this real quick. She's literally fine. A-hole yeah, friend. No. A whole friend. Never right. have dude, seriously. S seriously? <laughs> Let's She's good. No. I mean, no, we're not going home. She's fine. You're fine. She's look, look, she's fine. No. She's no. literally no. fine. No, she's not, not fine. No. No. Whenever no. you decide to do the backstroke on concrete, you are not fine. That's just word of <laughs> yeah, that, wisdom that's, that's from an old person. If you are swimming yeah. backwards on concrete, you are not fine. <laughs> yeah, you're not. You're not <laughs> no. fine. Just take it from me, a person that should know about swimming on concrete. No, right. it's not. It's not. Don't do it. Not good. Not good. Mm -mm. Drunk, 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 drunk. The six stages of being drunk on a train. Oh, God, on a train. Oh, God, happy? Okay, we got happy. One, laughing at nothing. Happy, come on. Everybody laughs at nothing when they're happy. Happy. Crying for no reason. Yeah. Where's two? Two, laughing at your own reflection. He forgot the crying part. Side aimed yeah, a little kid staring at her. <laughs> <laughs> She's trying to hide from herself now. You know you're right. in trouble when you try to hide Peeing from yourself. Your pants. Oh, of course. Oh. <laughs> of course. Of course. Of course. Four. She laughed so hard. Taking she a nap at the oh. table. Oh. Oh yeah. Napping at the table with the drink in your hand. All right. I'm yes. still going bad friend with this one too. Pinky's up. Because he's Proper still letting her drink. Fine. It's a girl. No. Pole no, dancing. No, Morgan, Morgan. Yeah. Morgan See, it's a girl. Oh, it's a girl, girl that's girl. letting her drink. I, Six. You're absolutely right. Exorcism. Exorcism? The power of Christ compels. <laughs> the power of Christ compels you. <laughs> <laughs> yep, I knew it. I knew she was going over the edge. Yeah. There's the exorcism that we're talking about. That I'll is a bad friend yourself. right there. Hey, Lenny should have did his voice to a whole bunch of possessed movies before oh he God, passed away. That would have been amazing. That would have been amazing. I'll swallow your soul. Perfect. Yeah. Oh, yeah. The <laughs> ace of swol so soul swallowing. Ace of oh. soul swallowing. 
So <clears throat> time to play the game. Yeah. <laughs> Come time here, to little play boy. the game. <laughs> too funny and it's it's like his sister and she's five it's right. like lenny's voice coming out of her oh right. my god that would be perfect well i would with, run for my own kid if that came out of her so yeah, yeah. we're yeah well with hey, the dad. new nope i'm done nope i'm out i'm out i don't care that <laughs> you're done. my kid find someone else to raise right. wolves raise people go find them right. I, apparently wolves are as good as i am apparently yeah uh hmm. I know what we're doing next. Uh so I don't need to ask. I just need to find Really? I have the same problem you do and I have more words on mine. I have no idea how you find yours. Yeah. Like mine actually have full on descriptions and yours are like like <laughs> one one letter like the T H uh-huh. T H Q. Yeah. Uh so I have no idea how you find your the stuff that you need to find. So Oh, I just put it on through my cell phone. Oh, if you're wondering if why the link is so small, yeah. Oh, that's okay. Phil, 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 Phil meets the movies. I, I like Phil meets the movies. Run. Phil, yeah. Phil, 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 Phil meets. Phil meets. Phil, Phil meets the movies. I hope that Phil meets the movies. Let's find out. Let's see if Phil meets the movies. He's gonna meet them all. Phil, I hope he asks the question Phil. again. I do too. I like the questions. They make the day go by quicker because then we have to think about stuff. Okay. I think the question is going to be yes. about Lemmy. <laughs> dude, if he has a Lemmy question, I'm going to fall out, dude. I'll be honest. Hello, Tick. That's me. Hello, Professor. That's you. Uh-huh. Um, Hola. It's the last week of September and the film 366 okay. film list uh, goes to the 1970s first. Then we recommend a different kind of trilogy uh, from the 1950s. Also, Phil Meets the Movies has a new film recommendation and another bad movie to avoid. Also, I want to explain my definition of D. D. The grade that I got in English every single year all the time. D. And science. Mm -hmm. D. And math. D. Although I was in smart kid class, so I got to see. Um, yeah. in school, a D <laughs> is still considered passing. Oh, I know that. Oh, I know that. Yeah. Uh, yeah. um, mm-hmm. so I still recommend seeing D films. Uh, I gave these films the easy classification of fair slash good. Uh, there are some movies okay. that lack a certain energy, but are still able to I entertain a person for two hours, which is an average movie length. Um, This is either based on story substance or a theme that carries a film forward to being recommendable. D plus D, D minus. And that goes from 6.4 to 5.3. Fair or good is six. IMDB, three stars. So for anybody out in the audience keeping score as to our system. He should have had a DB on there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. No doubt. I agree 100%. (laughs) I give totally this one a should DB. Have that. It's a DB. Yeah. It's a DB. You just figure it it's out. A DB. <laughs> yeah. Dude, the rest of the show, I just feel like being the Ace of Spurs. Ace of Spurs. Ace of Spurs. Sorry, nah, 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 nah. Just can't Even the it. guitars sound like Lemmy. Well, nah, the, other, nah, 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 the other thing about Lemmy, so yeah. anybody that's never seen Lemmy, and you're not going to anymore because he passed, but his microphone was always like this. Like, he always had it pointed like this so that he could play his guitar and stuff wouldn't get in the way. I, he was the only vocalist that I ever saw doing that. Um, Grease is the word, is the word, is the word. Grease is the word, Grease is the word. I got a full power, the power, the power. Grease is the word, is the word. So yeah, I'm not a huge um, fan. I, I'm, I like this film, I, I, but there's a problem with it. There's a serious problem with it, and it's called college. Uh, I happen to go to a musical, all-woman's Catholic college. This literally was an anthem. I mean, every freaking day, people are talking about this film. So let's see what Phil has to say about it. Today is Tuesday, September 26th. On this day, actress-singer Olivia Newton-John was born in 1948. Uh, Ask me what movie they what we should have done in Greece, 1978. There are scenes in the film that are silly, and none of these actors look young enough to be even college students. But if the film was completely serious, 
then it probably wouldn't have accomplished what it always wanted to do. It always wanted to. Sorry, English bad, me good. Mm. Uh, Greece yeah, yeah. Uh, gives you the images and tomes found in Happy Days, plus it gives you the energy and spark found in Footloose. Agree 100%. The most wonderful images yeah. found in the film are the scenes with 1950s icons such as drive-in movies and restaurants. The acting, singing, and dancing works fine in the film, and the songs are perfect yeah. for what each scene wishes to convey. And he gave it a B. Y um, you know what I could have yeah. went without on this movie? Uh, the music? Oh, sorry. Yeah, bad. bam a sham a boom a da bam to ba ba loom bam. Yeah. That song. Bam a sham a lam a da bam bam ba doom bam. Yeah. That's hilarious. Yep. Bam a sham a lam bam a dam a da boom bam. <laughs> and summer loving had me a blast. Uh huh. 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 Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hey Pinky, you gonna <laughs> you gonna get serious with him? Like this movie is such a double entendre. Like, are they doing it or are they just like looking at each other? I don't know. Go watch uh -huh. this film. It's like a flashback from the past. Um, I personally, <laughs> my my number one takeaway is Olivia Newton John. Uh, the movie that should have been recommended is and always will be Xanadu. 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 If you want to see, yeah. like. I'm not yeah. advocating drug use. Please don't do drugs, kids. But no. if you were to do drugs, no, Xanadu would make a hell of a lot more sense. I'm just saying. Roller skating, yeah. rainbows, musical. Like, that's literally Xanadu. It's the yeah. weirdest film. That is. It's just weird. Right. It's just a weird yeah. film. And I like I it. I love it. I love it. I haven't seen it in a mm -hmm. while. I need to go watch it again. I do understand that a lot of things from the 70s didn't age well. I went I went back one day and tried to watch Jesus Christ Superstar, which is an amazing 70s film. Ooh, yeah. But it is an amazing 70s film. Like be prepared for 70s right. everything. So if you're not yeah. into the 70s, do not watch Jesus Christ Superstar. Just saying. Well, see, I, I like the futuristic stuff like uh, Logan's Run and stuff like that. Logan's yeah. Run was amazing. And they yeah. also have that really weird one uh, with uh, Sean Connery with the big head, Zardoz, I think. Zardoz. Oh, yeah. Zardoz. Yeah. 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 There's so many good sci-fi films from the 70s. I agree. And the yeah. thing is, they had to figure out how to do effects um, practically. Uh, for practically. anybody, yeah. for any kid that's out there that doesn't understand what we mean, they literally had to make, like in Star Wars, they had to make ships blow up. They, they had to take a model right. and blow it up. They didn't have computer technology. Shocking. Although they did use computer technology on Star Wars. Do you know what they used it for? This is hilarious, by the way. Um, Princess Leia hair buns. Ooh, that's a good one. They put CDs on each side. No, actually. Um, <laughs> yeah. Uh -huh. they no, were it was actually. That's where it was actually for, That's where Cinnabon. Yeah, absolutely. It's. <laughs> I can't believe she didn't sue Cinnabon. Dude, they totally ripped her off. Um. No, it was the cameras. They used computers for the first time on the camera tracking. So what they would do is like they'd have this model that would be I'm going to make it this big, but it would be the size right. of this room. And then the camera would come down and go like this. And they do that like four, five, six times. And then they would just stack the film on top of each other so that gotcha. they could get the effect yeah. they were looking for. But yeah, it was the first time they started to use like computer controlled cameras. That's how old that movie is. Right. Well, mm, and with Star yes. Wars. Oops, sorry. If you get the ones that they before they did all the like we made it into 4K and all that stuff. Right, right, you right. Don't the see originals. Any boxes around it. It all looks great. It all looks perfect. But when they're like, we digitally enhance this, you're like, and oh, now I see everything. Yeah, yeah and I dumb. saw it, I saw it on a hundred freaking foot screen. I mean, I saw it on a ginormous screen and I never right. noticed any of that crap. I mean, I, I should have right. noticed it, but it's not until you, like you said, until you upgrade it and you fixed it and you made it yeah. better that you run yeah, into you these problems. Sometimes you don't need to do that stuff. Yeah. Like, Luke, don't kiss your sister. Stop. No, no. And like, I have yeah. the wrong version back here. This one that yeah, we've talked about it many a time, but it's very easy to tell which Star Wars you have and whether it's the correct one or not. Can you tell by reading the box? Oh, it's backwards. And I can't do the flippy thing because I screw everything oh, yeah, up when I do. Yeah. All, Can you all the Super Bowl numbers. Yeah. Um, sort of. Um, those three words right there tell you that this is not the original box set. Like those three <laughs> words right there. Yeah. Yeah. Um, yeah. I, I have been telling people recently about that. Me. 
Yes. I've been telling people about that recently. And there's a lot of people my age and older that are like, you're making that shit up. And I'm like, no, I'm serious, dude. I am yeah, totally no. serious. Mm -hmm. Anyway, back to the Bill meets the movies yes. network directed by Sydney Lumet. Uh, Thursday is September. Thursday is September 28th. On this date, British act Australian actor Peter Finch was born in 1916. He had a great career, but Network from 1976 was the film that enshrined him with the greats. His line, I'm mad as hell and not going to take it anymore is part of the American lexicon mm -hmm. today. Uh, unfortunately, right. he would receive the best uh, actor award. Wait a sec. Unfortunately, he would receive the best actor Oscar award posthumously for this film because he died the following year after principal photography ended um, on his last film raid in entebbe uh network 1976 again is brilliant is a brilliant look at the world of mass media especially the news it is highly recommended yeah. if you have not seen network i've seen it but it was a long time ago literally every other show that you've watched uh, there's three, I think, that are out right now. Uh, there's the one with Jennifer Aniston, um, where she's a network news anchor, and I forget who else. She plays okay. opposite uh, another yeah, famous actress. Apple. Correct. And then there's another one. Oh, uh, I forget Reese the other one. Reese Witherspoon. That's who she plays opposite. But there's uh -huh. another network one. But basically, if you watch this movie and then you watch those TV shows, they do almost the exact yeah. same angles and the same shots and the same this and gotcha. the same that. So uh, I, I recommend it. I haven't seen it in a bit uh, because it's from 1976. I probably saw it in the early 80s. Yeah. Um, but yeah, well worth the effort. Uh, and Phil obviously likes it. He gives it an A. That's a high rating for Phil. He's very particular, though. Yeah. Like, he, if you like stuff Phil likes, his rating system is perfect. Hey, what's going on, Mo? Mo hasn't been in here for a while. Uh, he basically, right. like, ripped my leg up one day because he got spooked. And then he hasn't been back. <laughs> so I'm surprised he came back today. Oh, he tried to jump off my face again. That's always fun. Okay, next movie up. Yeah, that's Phil, great. come on. Oh, what? I come love on. this movie. Me too. Young yeah. Frankenstein. Um, Friday is September 29th. No way. Uh, on this date, comedy actress legend Madeline Kahn was born in 1942. Uh, Young Frankenstein from 1974 is absolutely one of the top 10 greatest comedies ever made. Period. Done. I agree. Yeah. Put, a, put a pin yeah. in it. I if agree. you haven't seen it, yeah. literally yeah. stop watching this show and go rent it. Right. If you can, because I don't. Do, do people rent stuff anymore? Is that even somewhere? It? Yeah, I, I was going to say, might, but you have to do it in a basement somewhere. Yeah, yeah probably. Got to give got to give yeah. a guy like shillings. Here's my shillings. Right. Uh, the film is perfect from beginning to end. Agreed. Uh, it is a laugh riot from the start on top of the great delivery of comedic lines from the likes of Gene Wilder, Marty Feldman, Gene Hackman, Madeline Kahn and Cloris Leachman. Mel Brooks took it upon himself to create a world that was a believable spoof of the classic universal pictures frankenstein series of films from 1931 to 1948 you will not be disappointed by this film and if you are disappointed by this film i don't think you like movies just saying right well here, here are some things that like people that have never seen this have to just stop and just sit through it it's black and white uh, well, yeah, it. it's black and white. It's black. I, and it's funny because the box cover is color, but it, the movie itself is black right. and white. It, it, it's just classic. I mean, uh, it, Marty Feldman perfect. eyes and, is my favorite. Like, yeah. I love the way his eyes are are like. Oh, 100 percent. And all the like. Stuff that was that was meant to be funny, but it's in the background and like just naming things like they're looking for a brain and they're like Abby normal. And oh, yeah. they pick that one like it, it's Sounds so great. smart and it's it's Mel Brooks. Like, yes, if you guys have seen Spaceballs, you guys will right. love this. Like, right. yeah, it's funny because out of all of the Mel Brooks films, Spaceballs is my least favorite, oddly enough. And really? I I can't for whatever reason, there's something about it that I can't get through. Like, I've tried watching that film from beginning. I just put it on I in the it. background. I know. So many people do. It is the only one that I have a hard time with because and it's hilarious. Um, I mean, I've seen I watch it with other people and they just cry. 
is like the history of Earth. Is that what it's called? History the of the history world? of the world Something part like one. That? History of the yeah, world part one. Those, those are yeah. See that, that one I love. I can get through that. And funny enough, the history yeah. of the world part two just recently came out within the, like the last yeah. year and a half, two years. Okay. I haven't seen it yet. Yeah, I haven't seen it yet. But you know it's what? Okay. It's really hard to live up to a legend. Meaning that the history of the world part yeah. one legendary status hence the reason if you but, watch history of the world part two it's got everybody in it well yeah and I, what i love about it is it's mel brooks like he's he's all in that and he's the narrator and it's it's just it's mel brooks and yes. before he passes away he we needed something where he's in everything yeah like, i yeah. agree i agree okay Let's let's keep on moving. Keep on moving. Triple feature uh -huh. recommendation. Excellent. Saturday is September 30th. 